Welcome to our channel. Today we're diving into empowering workouts designed specifically for women. Fitness is not just about looking good, it's also about feeling strong, self-assured, and capable in your own body. We've curated a series of exercises to help you build strength, enhance flexibility, and boost confidence, no matter your current fitness level. This video will guide you through the fundamentals of strength training, dynamic warm-ups, high-energy cardio circuits, and essential cool-down stretches. So, are you ready? Let's start with some beginner-friendly exercises. Tip 1. Strength Training Basics Strength training, oddly enough, is often misunderstood. Some women fear it will make them look bulky, but that couldn't be further from the truth. In fact, it's a key component in toning muscles, revving up your metabolism, and enhancing your overall strength. And it's not just for the gym junkies out there, beginners can get in on this too. Let's dive into some basic exercises that you can easily incorporate into your routine. Squats, lunges, and push-ups are fantastic starting points. These exercises target major muscle groups, giving you more bang for your buck, so to speak. Squats work your thighs and glutes, lunges target the same areas but add a bit of balance work into the mix and push-ups are great for your chest and arms. One of the best things about these exercises is that they can be modified to suit your fitness level. You can do squats and lunges with or without weights and push-ups can be done on your knees or toes. But remember, it's not just about doing the exercises, it's about doing them right. Focus on your form to get the most out of each movement and to prevent injury. Listen to your body too. If something doesn't feel right, it's okay to adjust or skip that exercise. Remember to focus on form and listen to your body. Tip 2. Dynamic warm-up. Now, before we charge headfirst into our workout, it's absolutely essential that we take a few moments to warm up our muscles. This isn't just about preventing injuries, important as that is, it's also about priming our bodies to perform at their best. A dynamic warm-up routine is the perfect way to get things started. It's not about static stretches held for long periods of time, but rather, movements that get your blood pumping and your joints loosened up. Think of it as prepping your body for the main event. Let's kick things off with some arm circles. Extend your arms out to the sides and make small circles in the air, gradually increasing their size. This helps warm up your shoulder joints and gets those arm muscles ready for action. Next, we're going to do some leg swings. Stand tall, hold on to something for balance if you need to, and swing one leg forward and back. This warms up your hips and gets your legs ready to work. Finally, let's not forget about our core. Torso twists are a great way to warm up your abdominal and lower back muscles. Stand with your feet hip-width apart and twist your torso from side to side. That's it. A simple, yet effective dynamic warm-up routine. Remember, the goal here is to get your body moving and your muscles warm. Dynamic stretches help increase blood flow and flexibility, preparing your body for the workout ahead. Tip 3. Cardio Circuit Cardiovascular exercise is the queen of fitness realms. It's not just about burning calories, though it does that brilliantly but it's also about boosting your mood, improving heart health, and building endurance. Today, we're going to get our heart rates up with a fun and challenging cardio circuit that includes jumping jacks, high knees, and mountain climbers. Let's dive right into it, starting with jumping jacks. This classic exercise is a full-body workout that increases your heart rate and promotes whole-body movement. Stand straight with your feet together and hands at your sides. Jump out, spreading your feet wide and swinging your arms above your head, then jump back to the starting position. It's easy, it's fun, and it's a fantastic way to get your blood pumping. Next, we're moving on to high knees. This exercise is a bit like running on the spot, only you're lifting your knees as high as you can. It's great for building strength in your lower body and core, and it's an excellent way to push your cardiovascular system. Last but not least, let's tackle some mountain climbers. Start in a plank position, and then alternate bringing your knees to your chest. This exercise is a powerhouse, it targets your arms, shoulders, quads, and core, all while getting your heart rate soaring. Remember, the key to a successful cardio circuit is maintaining a steady pace. It's not about how fast you can go, but about keeping your heart rate up for a sustained period. And as always, listen to your body. If you need to take a break, take a break. Your body knows what it can handle. You've got this. Push yourself and remember to breathe through each movement. Cardio can be challenging, but it's also incredibly rewarding. Not only are you burning calories and improving your heart health, but you're also proving to yourself just how strong you really are. So keep going, keep pushing, and remember, you're doing an amazing job. Tip 4. Cool down and stretch. Now that we've worked those muscles, it's time to show them some love. 
Cooling down after a workout is just as important as the workout itself. It helps gradually lower your heart rate, reduce muscle stiffness, and start the recovery process. Let's start our cool down with some deep breathing. Inhale deeply, hold for a moment, then exhale slowly. Repeat this a few times, allowing your heart rate to come down naturally. Now let's move on to some stretching. Stretching after your workout helps to increase flexibility, reduce muscle tension, and enhance recovery. Begin with a simple hamstring stretch. Extend one leg in front of you, keeping the other bent. Reach towards your extended foot, feeling the stretch in the back of your thigh. Hold for 15 to 30 seconds and then switch legs. Next, move on to a quad stretch. Stand tall, hold on to something for balance if needed, and bend one knee, bringing your foot up towards your glutes. Gently hold on to your foot and feel the stretch in your thigh. Switch legs after 15 to 30 seconds. Lastly, let's do a chest opener. Clasp your hands behind your back, straighten your arms, and gently lift your hands upward. You should feel a nice stretch across your chest. Take a few minutes to stretch out those muscles and congratulate yourself for completing a great workout. Thanks for joining me today. Your journey to strength and confidence is inspiring. If you found this video helpful, give it a like, share it with your friends, and hit that subscribe button for more empowering workouts. Until next time, keep moving and stay strong.